In tonight's Health Center, vaccine myths. According to a new poll from the Kaiser Family Foundation, 36% of unvaccinated adults believe that the vaccines themselves cause COVID, the number even higher in populations of color, 41%. That is not true. That is a myth. 29% of unvaccinated adults believe the vaccines cause infertility. There, again, is no data to support that. That is false. And then this misconception, 52% of unvaccinated Latinos think that the vaccine will cost them money. This also not true. Joining us now to clear up some of these myths, help elaborate on the findings and offer some answers based on uh, data is Ashley Kurzinger. She is with the Kaiser Foundation. So let's talk about those first two myths for a moment. So people are under the impression that the vaccine causes COVID. And then the other myth is that the vaccine will cause infertility. What is really fueling that? And what are some of the, the things that people shared about their concerns around those two things? Yeah, I think what's really happening here is there was a lot of conversation about how quickly these vaccines were being developed and the new technology that was being used, when in actuality, the science behind these vaccines has been around for decades. And so because they, of the confusion around the newness, and that really led to the persistence of these myths. And what people are telling us is once these misconceptions and myths are addressed, that they feel more comfortable getting vaccinated or deciding to get make that choice for them and their family members. Does that happen after they have a conversation with their doctor? What is prompting that change in decision? Really, it's conversations with friends and family members they trust, but absolutely healthcare providers are the most trusted source of information. Let's talk about the Latino population and their hesitancy because they're concerned that the vaccine will cost them money. What can you tell us about that finding? Well, First off, all adults in the U.S. and children in the U.S. that are now eligible are able to get the vaccine at no cost. And what we know is that Hispanic adults are eager to get the vaccine, but they have some concerns. And one of these concerns is this misconception around costs. And so addressing that, letting populations know that it's not going to cost them anything to get vaccinated may increase vaccine intent among these populations. What more can we be doing as a society to dispel some of these myths and misconceptions out there? You know, a lot of people think that these myths are just existing on social media, but people are telling us that they're hearing this from their friends and family. Those are also major sources of information. So having conversation with your friends, with your family members, really talking about um, the safety of the vaccines and the fact that the vaccines are free, I think is going to be crucial in this next stage of the vaccine rollout. It's good to see more people getting the vaccine, but we need people to have, have the facts at ready. Uh, Ashley, we appreciate your time. Thank you. Thank you.